former three-division world champion, Sugar Shane Mosley has decided to join the recent pack, by announcing his retirement from boxing. In the last few weeks, Vladimir Klitschko, Juan Manuel Marquez, Timothy Bradley and Robert Guerrero made their own retirement announcements from the sport. I decided that, I'm older now. I'm not the same as I used to be, so I need to let it go as far as me trying to compete as a fighter anymore," Mosley told ESPN. I'm definitely always going to be around boxing. I'll still go to the gym and show people stuff, help them out. I still love boxing. It's still my life but just not as a fighter anymore. Mosley has been out of the ring since losing to then WBA interim welterweight champion David Avanesian, on May 28, 2016. There was a scheduled fight in Russia against undefeated prospect Mago Medkurbanov. But it was cancelled after Mosley underwent surgery for an elbow injury. What happened was my arm is breaking down, my knees, shoulders, Mosley said. My back is starting to break down. My body is telling me I'm older, and I can't do it at 100%. I can't see myself fighting again. I'd have to say I'm retired. Mosley capture world titles at lightweight, welterweight and junior middleweight. He fought a who's who of top names, including Oscar de la Hoya twice, Fernando Vargas twice, Vernon Forrest twice, Antonio Margarito, Floyd Mayweather Jr., Ricardo Mayorga twice, Manny Pacquiao, Saul Canelo Alvarez, Miguel Cotto, Winky Wright twice and many more. He is considered to be one of the best lightweights in the history of the sport, but made his mark when he jumped straight to welterweight, and secured an upset decision win over De La Hoya in 2000.